Hey everybody, I'm Steph Brandt. I am a Platinum Leader with Young Living Essential Oils and I'm here to do an Essential Oil 101 with you today. I am so excited about this class. It's my favorite class to teach and I just love um, meeting people's needs and sharing about how Young Living can change um, your wellness. And so we are gonna start talking a little bit about my story. We are gonna talk about the history of the company, some do's and don'ts, some safety precautions, and then we're gonna look at 12 different oils and what they do. And um, so we're just gonna kind of dive right in and tell you a little bit about how I got started. I was a blogger. I was at a blogging convention in Texas for Valpac. Maybe you get those little coupons in your local um, mail, uh, flyers and things like that, but they have the little coupons in them. And I was in Texas at this blogging conference with my eight week old and needed something to help um, with my milk supply and help to support my milk supply. And so my friend Rachel told me all about Young Living and I got my kit sight unseen, had it delivered to my front door in Pennsylvania, came home and it did not have the oil that I needed in it. So I went and I bought really cheap oil at a local store, did nothing. So I decided to talk to my friend Rachel again and she's like, no, no, you have to do Young Living, ours are different. So I ordered Young Living's, um, used it, and my ounces actually doubled in a day and I was sold ever since. So I started teaching classes about a year later. So for about a year, I just was kind of a closet oiler. I didn't really you know, talk too much about oils to other people. But after about a year, I started teaching local classes and that grew into what I now call Oily Uprising, which is my oily team. And we have people from all over the US. So. What I wanna do though, is I wanna talk a little bit about the history of the company too. So Gary Young started our company 25 years ago and uh, he basically was a self-studied herbalist who worked with people on their wellness journey and then eventually went to France and studied under a French distiller and was actually in a wheelchair for a while and kind of felt that you know he studied herbs and healed himself from that. And so that, you know, oils were just kind of like a next step thing for him. So he went to France, studied under the distiller, and then brought his first lavender shoot back in his boot <clears throat> in the early 90s. And so planted the first field, the first year with all volunteers, and then we became a company. So that's kind of a little bit about the history of Young Living, and it's just such, such a wonderful history that we have with our company. So the next thing that I want to talk to you about is seed to seal. So Gary was very much a self-studied botanist. He was very into plants and making sure that they were planted correctly in the right soil. He was very much, you know, um, very particular about that. And so uh, we we have something called seed to seal in our company, and you'll see it of that logo on almost all of our um, all of our you know marketing materials. And so what you're going to find is that seed to seal is. Um, you can go to seedtoseal.com and that is our guarantee to you that we are sourcing from the best plants. We are sourcing from farms that we either own or we partner farm with them. And so if we don't own our farm, we partner farm. And that means that we, um, they supply us with all of um, their crop. Basically, they are not allowed to sell to other brokers or anything like that. And so then they actually... I have to meet all of our strict seed to seal standards. And so that's why you're gonna find that our oils are different than a lot of the junk oils you're gonna buy from the store or other companies that, um, because we, and I've actually gotten to go to our Mona Utah farm. And so I've been to our farms and it's just amazing to see that process. We do not believe in pesticides. We don't even use organic pesticides on our um, on our plants. And if they, you know, are even to be grown in rows or versus grown, you know, freely, um, we hand weed them. So all of that bot good botany that goes into it is part of what makes seed to seal. And so if you want to check that out, go to seed to seal.com. And then the other thing is um, basically there are a couple, um, couple ways of how, like, how to use them. And we're going to get to that in a second here. But before I even do that, let's talk about um, just uh, there. Like I said, there are three ways to use them, but I want to talk to you about the safety precautions, but I also want to talk about how they work in your body. So when you put an oil on topically or you diffuse it in the air, it comes in contact with your skin. Um, usually it passes a blood, blood brain barrier in 20 minutes or less and metabolizes in your body in four hours or less. And so it processes very quickly through the body. And so when you oil to support the body, you might need to reapply frequently throughout the day. And that's extremely important to know. And if oils are, um, again, they process through the liver differently than um, what a synthetic medication would, and oils are not the same as a synthetic medication. So for example, um, in Western medicine, synthetic medications force your body to do what it has to do, like it forces your body to do it, where your essential oils support your body in doing what it naturally should do. So one example is my grandmother 
had um, an, uh, an episode of really, really high blood pressure. And so I oiled her with oils that support the cardiovascular system. I didn't tell her to stop taking her blood pressure medication. And just so if she'd have taken, let's say a synthetic blood pressure medication and another synthetic, that would actually drop her blood pressure so low it might go dangerously low. But with oils, oils do not work like medication in the body, and so they don't force your body to do what it has to do. It helps support the body in doing what it's already doing. And so, like I said, they are not synthetic medication. And that's why you can use them synergistically really with your medication. Or, you know, like I said, they they are they just operate differently in the body. And so that a lot of times, because they do metabolize so fast and they do pass that blood-brain barrier so fast, sometimes you can feel the effects of your oils very quickly um, in terms of supporting your body, okay? But again, remember, I'm not a doctor. I can't diagnose, treat, or prescribe anybody with our essential oils. So I am literally here to tell you a little bit just about what the oils do and how they can support the body, okay? So the other thing you need to know is that they're made two ways. They are either cold pressed from the rind of the fruit or they are low heat steam distilled. And so when I got to go to the Mona Utah farm, I got to see all of the oils being um, pressurized in the big vats and then a condenser unit sucks out that air and water and it puts it in a holding tank and I got to see that oil float on top. And seed to seal guarantee is that we are only bottling that oil. There's no floral water added. There are no chemical chem synthetic chemicals added. Um, our oils are directly shipped to our, our company from our farms or our partner farms. And so we do not broker oils. We do not put synthetics in our oils. Um, I've been to our distribution center. I have been to our call center. I've been to our farm. And so I can vouch for the fact that I've been there and I've seen it in action, okay? So I just wanna, you know, may really reassure you that you're getting the best of the best with this. So the other thing that I wanna talk to you about is uh, the three ways to use them. And so there are three ways that you can use your essential oils. And in the premium starter kit that we're gonna talk about tonight, you will get this um, Desert Mist Diffuser. You can choose between this and the Dew Drop. And then there are other diffusers you can choose for a little bit higher cost, but this is a beautiful diffuser. It flickers like a candle. It has seven different colors. It comes with a one-year guarantee. And so I love our Desert Mist. And that is, um, that is this is actually my favorite diffuser of all of them. And so you're going to do that aromatically. That's one aromatic way to use your oils. The second way is to direct inhale from the bottle, sometimes with stress away. I'm just gonna direct inhale. And other times I'm gonna put the oil in my hand, put a drop in my hand, and then go like this and inhale through what I call cupping. So I call that cupping, cupping, and you're gonna do that with your hands on your face. And then on the second way to use them is topically. And we like to make roll-ons a lot of times with our essential oils. So you're actually going to um, put your essential oil in a, like a 5 ml or a 10 ml glass roll-on, and then you are also going to add some carrier oil. The reason that we do that is because essential oils need to be diluted on the skin. Carrier oils can be anything like sweet almond oil, fractionated coconut oil, or um, grapeseed oil. Like I said, sweet almond oil. Um, you just wanna put them with a fat, your essential oil with a fatty oil, and then just dilute it so that it doesn't go directly on the skin, which can cause a rash or irritation, and we don't want that. So the third way to use them, um, some Young Living oils are called Vitality oils, and so they are white labeled um, as per, you know, the uh, you, can, you can take them internally as per the directions on the label, okay? So Vitality means that the, these white label, it says Vitality right here under its name, that that means that you can take this um, oil internally. So three ways to use them, topically, inhalation, or aromatically, and then some oils can be taken internally. And so um, that is really a next step class. We do not really talk a whole lot about ingestion to, to people who are just getting started, but you definitely can start using them aromatically and topically right away, okay? If you do take them internally, sometimes you're gonna put an oil maybe in water and drink it, <coughs> just like a drop. Sometimes you're gonna put them in a capsule and take them internally. That's entirely up to you how you choose to go on your oily journey, okay? So the, the biggest um, safety precautions we like to tell you is never, ever, ever put them directly in the eye or directly in the ear. Do not wear citrus fruits in the sun because if you're going to put grapefruit oil on or lemon, you're gonna get a really nasty burn. And the third thing is um, if you have children 10 and under, we have a particular book we like you to get. And so we will, if you um, are interested in that book, please make sure you get that book. It's a third party reference guide that we really do prefer that you have so that you know how to apply oils to your children, okay? children 10 and under especially. So moving forward, we are going to talk about the uh, 12 oils that come in the premium starter kit. 
and I, the worst part is that you can't smell them on a video. But um, what I do want you to do is I, I do want to at least give you one or two uses for each of these oils. So we're going to start with Digize. It's a vitality, so it can be taken internally. Think digestion. It supports the digestive system. So that anytime a little bit on your belly. Um, when I was pregnant in the early morning, there were some mornings where I was heavily using that oil. Um, and so, you know, would definitely put that on my belly, would definitely inhale it. My grandma even drinks a drink a drop of it in her water. I don't love the taste of it. This is not an oil I would diffuse. I prefer to use it topically. Sorry, I have three dogs, so you might hear them in the video. And then peppermint essential oil is great for um, supporting the body. I like to use it, obviously, when I'm pregnant in the morning as well. I used it with the Digize. I love to inhale it, especially first thing when I get up in the morning. If I was feeling a little who, I would like totally just cup and inhale some peppermint. One drop of peppermint is like 20 cups of herbal tea. Also, sometimes when I'm like, oh, at the end of a work day, I like to put it over my forehead, on my temples, and the back of my neck. And so that's another great way to use that. I love to use lemon essential oil. It kind of reminds me of like a Goo Gone. If you want to get rid of like stickers on a shirt that have gone through the dryer or gum and sweatpants, or maybe you have, you know, anything with degreasing, like with cleaning, I put this on the, my cooktop hood and love to clean with that. Lemon is a great, um, you know, oil to put in your water, like one drop at a time. It makes your water really super refreshing. And so does, by the way, Citrus Fresh. Citrus Fresh and Lemon are also, um, like I said, citrus oils are all mood lifters. And so they're great for supporting emotions. They're also your least expensive oil. And so it's wonderful to put them in your diffuser because they're cheap and you don't need any air fresheners anymore. And any kind of, we only use, um, you know, essential oils to freshen the air in our home because burning a candle for an hour is like smoking a cigarette. That's what the research shows. We also know that there are many toxic synthetic chemicals in air fresheners and we should not be breathing those things in, especially in small confined places like a bathroom. So I love to use some little glass spray bottles and replace all of my air fresheners in and I tell all my clients to do that with um, their citrus oils because they're they're inexpensive and they make a great air freshener. Um, I also love to use Raven to support my um, respiratory system. There are certain times of the year where I'll rub this on my chest. I was just rubbing this on my 18 month old chest um, just over the last couple weeks. I have it in a roll on for him. Um, this uh, lavender is like the Swiss army knife of oils. I love to use it for skin. Anything where the skin is like, uh, not so good. I love to use that. Um, my son actually um, had some, you know, kind of a little bit of something going on in his arm. And so we love to just dilute this in some lotion base and just rub that over that area. So lavender is also great for sleep support. It has so many amazing uses. And so by the way, when you become a member, we love to send you some kind of welcome guide. And if you haven't been given one by the person who introduced you to oils, you can order one from me. And that is um, something that you can just DM me about. But if I personally bring you into Young Living, I'm going to probably give you that as your welcome gift. So we have a third party reference guide that's kind of like a little encyclopedia where you can get all the uses for all the oils and all the other things that they help with. The other thing, the next oil I love is Panaway. Panaway is amazing for like, um, just to be honest, during my menstrual cycle, I just use it right across my abdomen. I also, if I'm having like, uh, or like a muscle fatigue, I will rub it over my muscles. I'll put it on my forehead. I love to mix it with some copaiba or lemongrass, two of my other favorite oils, um, to really just help um, support my body during those times. The next one that I'd love to talk about is Peace and Calming. Also another great one for emotional support. And that actually is um, goes perfectly with Valor, which also comes in your kit. So Peace and Calming and Valor um, and Lavender are three of the main ingredients that we use to make Liquid Calm is what we like to call it. We'd love to make Liquid Calm where it just really supports our emotions, helps with just to relax and support us with relaxation. Two um, really amazing oils. My next favorite one that I use every single day of my life is Stress Away. I love to put it just on my forearms, rub them together, inhale. I also wear it in my diffuser necklace. It's one of my, my probably my one of my top favorite oils. Frankincense essential oil is amazing. It has so many uses, just Google it. Frankincense essential oil uses, I'm not even gonna go into the list. There are so many great things for this. I love to use it in my a drop in my moisturizer on my skin. It's great for cell renewal. I like to actually drink a drop in my in my Ningxia Red shot every day, which if you get your kit, um, I will talk to you in a second about Ningxia Red as well. 
And then my last favorite oil from the kit is Thieves. And um, I, there's actually a story about the thieves. Um, it's called the Four Thieves, you know, kind of story. And so during the bubonic plague, there were spice merchants and they were grave robbing and they got caught and they went before the judge and they were like, well, how are you? The judge is like, how are you doing this and not getting sick? And they're like, we rub ourselves down with our spices. We wear this beak like mask. And then, you know, we don't get sick or whatever. So all of the ingredients that are, that, and that's not proprietary to Young Living. Um, there, you can Google the Four Thieves blend and, um, but this is Young Living's version of it and it is an immune support oil. I roll it in a roll on on my neck every single day to support my immune system. If I'm feeling yucky, I do it every hour and it is the bomb. Let me tell you what, I will never be without this oil ever, ever, ever. I also love to diffuse it. Um, I have, you know, been a teacher and, and I love to, you know, diffuse it in the classroom. So if you have a classroom, you know how that goes too. And so these are the 12 amazing oils that come in your kit and just a couple of things that they do. Um, again, we have a whole reference guide to help you with that as well. Um, but then also the other thing that comes in your kit is a packet of thieves cleaner, which I just had right here. I thought, oh, here it is. Okay. So this is going to come in your kit. You're going to buy a bottle like this, put this in your bottle, fill it slowly with water. You do not need any other cleaner. This is it the only cleaner I have used for four years. And it is less, makes it when you buy the concentrate bottle, it makes these bottles less than a dollar a bottle. You can um, spray it everywhere. I use it, at, there's no other cleaner in my home. My bathrooms, my sink tops, my toilets, my countertops, my mirrors, my windows. Um, I pre-treat stains with it. I do all kinds of stuff with this and you can spray your fruits and vegetables with them and eat them. So if you have any questions about that, DM me, but my most amazing favorite product, everybody that comes to an in-person class with me gets a free bottle of that to try. And then the last thing are your Ningxia Red packets that come in your kit. There are, and there's also a hand sanitizer as well, um, a, a pocket, um, like almost like a pocket size hand sanitizer uh, that comes as well, or which is made with thieves. And then we also have these Ningxia Red packets. And so Ningxia Red is made from pureed goji berry or wolfberry from the Ningxia province in China. Um, Young Living is the largest importer of goji berry in the whole United States. When you get this, and we can either get it in packets like this, or you can get it in wine bottles, it actually has a sediment in it because it is made with puree that you have to shake up because you can see that pureed berry in there. And so what you're gonna do is either do four mornings by opening these up, sticking them in the fridge, do a half in the morning, half the next morning, and so do four mornings because you have two and two, or do a morning, evening, morning, evening. And so that is going to give you, uh, that's definitely gonna give you a sustainable energy for the entire day that's amazing. It is not like a caffeine high, so it's not like a five hour energy shot. It's literally just so filled with B vitamins and amino acids, which help your liver detoxify that it's actually um, an energy, a sustainable energy, not an energy like high, okay? We have a different product called Ningxia Nitro that has naturally occurring caffeine that does that. So these also come in the bottom of your packet. With your whole kit, all of the stuff together retails for $400. You can get it for $165. That's it. Seriously, it's a deal. It's a steal. They do it for all new members because they want you to be able to get started with all the stuff that you need. And your membership comes with that. And your membership means that you save 24% off of everything you buy for a year. At the end of that year, you just have to spend another 50 PV with, on product. So like it's like 50 bucks basically. Um, so that means you don't have to buy anything for an entire year if you don't want to. And at the end of that year to renew your membership, you're just gonna spend another $50. But if you're replacing everyday items in your home by either making those items yourself or maybe you want to buy them directly from Young Living then my assumption is that most people will be able to have no problem keeping their membership we have lots of tricks of the trade we're gonna teach you hacks we're gonna teach you ways to save with Young Living so if you want to live a non-toxic uh, synthetic free lifestyle this is a way to go for you and so we even have an auto ship program if you want to get on uh, with the kit you can even get on it when you buy purchase your kit and that actually sorry my 18 month old is making all kinds of noise back there but again with the auto ship program you can sign up for that every month it's fifty dollars a month minimum and then if you um, want to spend more we have free oils that come depending on how much you spend but you also get points back so it's like cash back points you do not have to do auto ship you do not have to do this as a business. 
okay? This is entirely your oily journey. We have all kinds of classes to support you once you get started, and we even want you to get a notebook to take some oily notes so that you have, um, you know, all kinds of, you know, information that you're gonna be getting, and so you might wanna take notes. I'm also gonna send you a welcome letter in the mail with all kinds of recipes for roll-ons, recipes for your diffuser with your kit, all kinds of great information as well. You can even take classes directly on your phone. You can take classes. We have a Facebook group with a thousand members or more that you can join, ask questions 24 seven. We are here for you. We want you to be part of our oily team. So with all that being said, just wanted to wrap up and let you know that this, this is a great opportunity. This stuff is, um, you know, so greatly priced with this kit. If you go to sign up, um, you can go to my Instagram and there's a link for sign up. If you're doing this from the blog, um, there's uh, how to get started with essential oils on the right side. But again, if you want to just do the link on the Instagram, it takes you directly sign up. We would love to get you started on your own oily journey. So again, I'm Steph Brandt. Thank you for checking us out. Hope you guys have a great day.